Hey guys, I wanted to throw together a quick update video on how you go about adding Twitch to Roku. So what you want to do is head on over to my.roku.com slash account slash add, and I'll put a link to this webpage right at the top of the video description. So once you're on this webpage, after you log in to your Roku account, what you want to do is in the channel access code area, type in Twoku, and then click add channel. And then it gives you this warning. Essentially what this is, is you acknowledging that you're accessing a non-certified channel. So if you're good with that, go ahead and click OK. And then it says add Twoku to your Roku account. And it is a free app, at least at this point in time. And click where it says yes, add channel. And then it says the channel Twoku has been added to your channel lineup. And it typically channels will show up automatically within 24 hours. But we can speed this process along by going to settings, system, and then doing a system update. So I'll walk you through those steps next. All right, guys, so now I'm over on my Roku player, and to see if you have the Twoku app, just go into the apps area, and it should be right at the bottom of your apps page. We can see that it is right here in this instance. Now, if Twoku hasn't shown up yet, you can do a system update, so we go over and go down to where it says settings, then over and down until you get to where it says system, and then over and down to system update, and click OK on system update. And then you can check now for a system update and it's going to check to see if you have any new software and it will get you up to date. And at that point in time, if you didn't have Twoku before, it should have added the Twoku app. So we can click OK, go back to the home screen. And then again, the new applications are going to show up towards the bottom of your apps page and it's right there. So I'm going to click OK to launch the Twoku application. And it has live channels. You can search. You can enter in your Twitch ID to get a more catered experience to the channels that you follow. And I've been using the Twoku app, and it's a really nice option to have on Roku as an alternative since they don't have the actual Twitch TV app. So I hope this video was helpful. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing, and I'll catch you back here next time.